before people start clicking off. How many bookings have you got so far with your party bus rental business? I got uh, seven bookings so far. Seven bookings so far. Anything else in the pipeline? Pause. Oh, yeah, a lot more in the pipeline. Uh, I would say at least like a good handful, like a good four or five still in the pipeline right now. Nice. That's where I was at. Okay, so seven bookings, four or five in the pipeline. On average, how much are you charging them for, the customers? Um, I would say on average around... Fifteen hundred. Fifteen hundred. Okay, so that's yeah. like usually like the minimum. Yeah, well, my minimum I think was about eleven hundred or like twelve fifty. Okay, and easy. you know I I've had some as high as uh like three thousand. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Cool. Decent pro um uh, profit margins. Yeah. Yes, How sir. you liking your partners so far? How many partners do you have anyway? So right now I have about four legit partners that uh, work with me on price and they know exactly what I'm doing and they kind of help me out deliver, you know, um, the experience and the irresistible offer. Nice, nice. So yeah, I got them on speed down now. I can just call them anytime and get a quick <laughs> quote and, you know, they make it work for me. That's what I'm talking about, man. That's that's where it's at, man. Good job, man. I'm, I'm so Appreciate proud it. of you, man. Because Look, it's, it's not that big a difference between you and other people in the group, but they think it is. I'm like telling people that, <laughs> dog, I, he doesn't, I'm not telling him something different than I'm telling y'all. I don't yeah. show favoritism. So people got to learn how to look within, but I ain't going to get to the preaching and everything. All right. So which platform um, are you having the most success with? Uh, Thumbtack by far. Thumbtack by four. Okay. Yeah. So I, you were on the knot. What was the other one you were on that, that you got one from? Uh, The knot and wedding wire. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so I got, I got a pretty, a pretty big party for a hundred people on the knot. Nice. Nice. Yeah. What about the one on the wedding wire? Wedding wire. Um, I don't think I've actually booked one through there. I got one that's on the, that's in the pipeline, but I haven't actually got them booked. Okay. Oh, and something else that I didn't even really mention, uh, Groupon. I just got my first Groupon voucher sold yesterday, I guess. Ah. So yeah, I'm not I'm not even sure how to really work Groupon. I just posted it and yesterday they emailed me and said that I got my first one sold. So that that's that's actually eight if I count that one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Okay, so did you have any trouble uh, getting your, getting your group on approved? Uh, no, not at all. Not at good, all. Good, good, good. Uh, you can keep it quiet if you want to, but if you if you if you want to say this, um, like when they're when they're asking for like an address and all of that stuff, what are you doing? Uh, Groupon. Yeah. Um, did they ask me for an address? I'm not even sure if they asked me for one, but most of the time I just use my company address. I got a uh, I got a virtual address that I use. Good guys uh, watching this. There's a company I don't have an affiliate. I, I got an affiliate link, but I can't remember where it's at. So I'll just tell you this: <laughs> It's a company called iPostal, right? Just Google iPostal, y'all. Now it might not work too well with the uh, the snack pack, like you know, but. Like for things like Groupon, Thumbtack, and all of that, when they want an address and stuff, it can still work for that. So Google iPostal One uh, service. Okay. All right. So, all right. So eight bookings so far, and some in the pipeline. Um, um, <laughs> on average, fifteen hundred. I remember one. The last one we was talking about was around two thousand eight hundred or three thousand, something like that. Yeah. Uh, Thumbtack is your winning platform so far, and our Groupon. How long did how long did you have your Groupon got Groupon up before that one came in? I had my Groupon up for about about a month and a half. Nice. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So that one's a little bit slow, but the, <laughs> hey, it came in though. Like, it came how, in. Uh, what was your price on the Groupon? Do you remember? Honestly, man, I do not know. Like, like, one, like once I sold. I got one sold yesterday. I had to contact Groupon and be like, hey, like, what do I do next? I don't even know <laughs> the next steps. Because honestly, I just posted it and just kind of yeah. forgot about it because Thumbtack <laughs> keeps me so occupied. I'm getting leads every day on Thumbtack. So come on, y'all. Come on. See, yeah. hey, yeah. did you know Shaquem is still people in the group that haven't even set up a Thumbtack? 
I don't know why. I was trying to show them how simple it is, and then I got I got you know my IP address got tagged, so so I was like, yeah. okay. But y'all are in the United States. You ain't got no excuse, man. The leads come in so fast. Like it's no excuse. Just throw up your Groupon. Throw up your throw up your thumbtack. Throw up your wedding wire. Throw up the knot. How much you had to put down on the knot? The knot. Um, so the knot and the wedding wire are connected. So for me, getting both of those subscriptions, they gave me a price of one twenty four a month. Come on, man. Come on, y'all. Come yep. on. And these people are bringing the jobs to you. So he has about four partners. And whenever the jobs come in, I mean, all they got to do is collect the payment and pass it off, right? Are you having any issues with the that part, like the passing the payments off? Um, No, not at all. Not at all. The customers pays me. I call my partners, and they're excited about it. I, I send them cash with however they want it, Venmo, Cash App, <laughs> however. <laughs> He said they're excited about it. See, the good thing about it, man, right now is you're building partnerships, man. Like, and I ain't just saying fulfillment partners. I'm talking about like real partners. For example, like, like it's somebody that sold them those vehicles. It's somebody that sold them the lot that they hold the vehicles on and the, the property. Like, you'll be able to uh like meet different business owners through these partnerships. And you know what I'm saying? Like, it's like a spider web. It branches out. So just take care of these people because eventually down the line they'll be able to take care of you as well um and what i want you to start focusing on like this is why i'm going to uh, show you how to scale it today is because i don't want you to just get this commission i want you to be able to like uh, you know once we get a little bit more trust from them, i want mm -hmm. you to get, uh, build a hybrid okay so you want to get paid in a hybrid method so you get like a um, um, um a dedicated amount of money like per month from them all right. And you get what you're getting on, you know, as far as like how it's going right now. And then yeah. we're going to start plugging in our systems since they'll trust us now. We'll be able to uh, plug in systems. For example, it might be stuff wrong with their website. You can have their website redone, but now they'll have to pay the subscription for the website and the hosting. You get commission on that. Hold on one second. All right. Okay, so you're going to be getting the commission on, on, on the websites and all of that. On top of that, we want to get access to their email and their mobile list as well. We want access to their customer data, right? If you do that, if you ask them for that right now, they're going to like, you know, but continue doing what you're doing. Guys, look, check this out. When they get a second location, you're in that. When they get a third location, you're in that. This is what this is what I teach an agency to partner. I teach the same stuff. Like this is what I teach an agency to partner. Once you get them to trust you, now you infiltrate, right? So now it's like you're buying into the business. You're becoming a real partner. Mm -hmm. right? You can get equity, all different types of stuff. So they're excited to get these from you right now. Let's say you you become one of their biggest like streams. They have no choice but to like give you equity in the business. Now, imagine you have an equity in a business. You never started. You wasn't there when they came with the idea. You didn't have to build a credit up or get a loan or do none of that. So this is you showing your worth right now so that later on you can actually solidify your placement. Got that? Got it. Yep. That's why I say I wish I knew this stuff back then because I would have been, been bought into like 15 different dang on limo companies. Yeah, All right. sure. <laughs> All right. So. Now that we know you're doing good, man, like I said, I'm super proud of you. Um, if there's any issues, you just let me know, and I'm, I'm going to help you with that as well. Um, so the first step of scaling this up, we're going to do this differently than I did back then. You're going to use exactly what you're doing now. Have you ever got those emails? Um, uh, I don't know how active you are, but back in the day, I used to be active. <laughs> uh, <laughs> like you'll buy whey protein, right? Mm -hmm. you know, like whey protein, like 20 bucks or something like that. Then you'll start getting emails. They don't off the back start offering you different products. What do they offer you? Same products. Exactly. More of the same. Only thing better than money is more money, mm -hmm. right? 
okay, if I'm getting uh, good results from this whey protein, shoot, offer me a bundle. Like, oh, hey, you can get a three-month supply from right here. We see you like it. Oh, after that, hey, what about a year's supply? And we just take off four months of the payments. Boom, right? So, like, more of the same. So what do I mean? Now you need to partner with individuals, you, whether it's your friends, family, or whatever. The same thing you did, have them do. What do I mean? They need to make thumbtack accounts. Why? So it's just like what I do on Google. Like I call it the rank hostage method where we try to take as many spots as we can. So no matter what, when the customer lands on Google for a keyword, they're going to buy from us. So imagine the customer coming to thumbtack and they leave your profile, but the next one that they click on is also yours too. Now it's going to have yeah. a different name. It's going to have a different name. You don't want them all, same, of course, right? It's going to all appear to be a different company, right? But you got four or five, six of those on there. You're going to get the booking, okay? So that is what you want to do on Thumbtack. You want to do that same thing on Groupon. You want to do, I don't care if you have to buy your way in. If you got to tell your cousin, yo, I'll give you a hundred bucks or I'll give you 10% of what I earn from this listing right here. This is another way of getting free employees too. They can handle the leads that come in, right? So that's the first step. I want you to, uh, do they already do? You, I'm pretty sure some of your partners do. Uh, the closest one, work with the closest one. You don't need a million okay. right now. The closest partner that you have, uh, I want you to get him to, uh, um, verify a new Google business profile. I'm pretty sure they already got, they should already have one at least, yeah. but if they, if they don't, then yeah. But it, you're casting a net basically. Okay. You can go fishing with a hook or you can go fishing with a net. If I'm in a hairy, which one should I go fishing with? Uh, net. Exactly. Yep. I mean, dog, I got a family of five and I only got an hour Whereas the hot spot, let's throw that mug in there and just pull it up and go, right? When I was in Mexico, man, uh, uh, in the morning, I used to watch the, uh, the fishermen on the beach. Like, we had this place off the beach, and they used to have this net that was like <laughs> like a football field or something. I don't know. So it would be like a couple guys go down that end, and a couple guys go down that end. And they'll just walk into the ocean mm -hmm. in there for a second, and then they'll just walk back. And the net will be like just full and they'll just start like selling the fish and doing their thing. Like and then you'll see you'll look a little bit further down and it'd be a dude with a little fishing ride that's been there since the sun came up. I'm like, dog, <laughs> come on, man. So once you got something working, you know you got the fish, the fish are biting there. Now mm -hmm. you need a net. Now you need a net. So thumbtack is your, your, that's your hot spot. That's the pond where the fish is biting. Now you need a net. So you need three, four, five listings if you possibly can. If you got to pay people to do it, do whatever you got to freaking do. Also, I remember you asked the question. Um, let me get the answer for you right now. I meant to do a live stream on it and I had freaking forgot. OK, so here we go. Thumbtack autoresponders is one called Magic Responses uh, is another one. The one I recommend is called Sign Post. I don't have an affiliate link for it, so you just go to it, right? So sign posts, and the mm -hmm. other one is magic responses, all right? So those are the two autoresponders that I recommend that can help you so you won't uh, lose out on some of those leads. If y'all are watching this right now and you're already in copy and paste rentals, that's some autoresponders too, because I remember we got a sister that was in there, and she left. She left. It's a sad story. She left. Uh, she... I think she paid for like 18 leads or something like that. And she didn't get any one of them. Uh, maybe it's because of the schedule or something, but I think she was getting to them late. So these auto responders guys will help it, help you to not miss out on the lead. You'll be able to program them to automatically respond with your irresistible offer and, and engage and start a conversation with the people so they don't go somewhere else. But also, like I said, if you're casting this net, if you have multiple listings on these directory platforms, you're you're really not going to be able to lose the the job. They're going to think, ha, I don't have to deal with you, but the next profile is going to be yours too. So, yeah. <laughs> okay, so that's another way of getting more leads. That's the way you want to scale up. Of course, you want to start then going into more cities. Okay, so uh, right now, how many cities are you in? You're in one? No, I'm in a lot of cities I'm right now. I'm in like 
I'm technically in like four different states, nice. but uh, I'm in I'm in like a tri-state area, so I kind of okay. just cover the whole tri-state, and then uh, I also am in uh, North Carolina too. Okay, cool. Yeah. Oh, and raise up, take your shirt off. No, all right, <laughs> all right. But uh, okay, so yeah, you want to like you know start plotting, you know start doing a little bit of research. You might even want to call around. Don't, don't, don't. When you call and do market research to other limo companies and 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 the party bus companies, don't let them know you're a transportation company either. Um, yeah. You know, make it seem as if you're an event planner. OK, that's a little hack for the rest of you guys. OK, because they'll lie to you when you're doing market research if they think you're in the transportation. Right. So, like, you know, when you hit them up, you're like, yo, I do event planning for parties and stuff. Do you get a lot of calls like, you know, because I want to make sure this is a good market for me to go into because I'm thinking about going into Los Angeles. No, we get a little bit. This, we get about 15 calls per week. Blah, blah, blah. Cool. Perfect. All right. So now, like, start doing scouting for areas like that. Go incognito, right? Um, um, and then start in those places. That's where you can start making your extra thumbtack accounts and all of that stuff like that. Now, check this out. It's something called multi-login, right? Unless you want to do like what you was just talking about with me, you can get on a Zoom with your partners. The reason why I'm saying this is because um, handling all of these uh, thumbtack accounts Sometimes they'll tag your IP address and then they'll shut down the duplicates and you're like, damn, dude, right? I was starting to get some leads from that one right there. So yeah. it's a software called Multi-Login that we used to use. Come on, golly, this alarm keep going off. Hold on. Next time, I'm going to tell her to cut off all the damn alarms, man. Okay, so <laughs> it's a software called Multi-Login that would allow, it, it'll make it appear to whereas if you in a whole bunch of different states and you're logging in from a whole bunch of different computers, so it won't trigger anything. Um, I forgot how much okay. it costs, but I'll send it to you. I think it's only like a 100 or 200 bucks or something like that, but it helps like if you're trying to scale up hella TikTok accounts without getting flagged, Instagram accounts and all of that stuff. So it works the same way with Thumbtack. So it'll make it appear as if you're in a different area on a different computer, a different person, blah, blah, blah. Okay. So if you got cousins and now, but, but the alternative to that is if you don't want to use that, then uh, get on your little zoom call with your cousins and all of that stuff. Maybe you guys have like a morning meetup, you know, your cousin in Los Angeles, your cousin in Cleveland, your cousin in Atlanta. Y'all get yeah. on there every morning, check your leads, discuss business, blah, blah, blah. Have them logging in and reporting back to you, you know, give them a Slack or a WhatsApp number so y'all can, you know, they can hit you up real fast. Like, yo, a lead just came in. What should I say? Blah, blah, blah. That's a manual way of scaling. The, the other best way that it, with a VA and multi-login, those those are the two options for now, right? Okay. Okay. All right. So are you getting value from this? Is this helping at all? Yeah, for sure. And when you say like uh, the multi-login will kind of, prevent you from getting shut down so you you're saying like uh make completely new thumbtack accounts yes. okay gotcha don't gotcha I told, don't tell them i told you though <laughs> <laughs> all right so so you don't recommend like uh hosting like multiple companies under one account hell no no okay gotcha gotcha I mean, because check this out like let's say let's say you start getting bad reviews on that account just because you have different offers and stuff like that um, don't mean that people won't go and check out your reviews with the other stuff. You see what I'm saying? So yeah. we want to have everything separate, just like, uh, well, I can't start giving tax info, <laughs> but, but yeah. Uh, yeah. Anyway, I ain't gonna say all that stuff on here, <laughs> but <laughs> you want to have, you know, like keep your assets safe. You know what I'm saying? Just in case you get, if you get sued and it's attached to your name, all your customers, like they're gonna stop going to your restaurant, they're not gonna go to your movie theater, they're not gonna go to your fashion week show, they're not gonna buy your shoes. Like that's how it that's how it works with humans. They're like, but yo, his food is delicious, but I hate that mug, you know what I'm saying? So I'm not yeah. buying it anymore, right? So we want to make sure you you know you're detached from a lot of the different accounts. Okay, so now an another thing you can do. This is the last thing that I'm gonna let you go. Well, first, I'm going to let you ask any questions. Yeah. All right. Uh, integration partners. Have you begun getting integration partners yet? 
the integration partners, um, as far as like what? Okay, so related, uh, super closely related niches. For example, the event planners, um, limousine owners. So for, ex okay, check this out. If you hit up a limousine company and they don't have a party bus, that doesn't mean they don't get inquiries for that. If, if it's your birthday, would you rather be in a limo or would you rather be in a party bus in 2024? Party bus all day. Exactly. So when people reach out to them, the only option that they usually have is a stretch Hummer or a pink stretch Cadillac uh, Escalade, right? Yeah. But if I want a party bus and they don't have one, they, guess what that means they have to do? Outsource. Outsource or turn down money. So yeah. the best thing they can do is create a little page, an extra page or a button for you. Okay, yeah. Need party bus, go here. And you just give them a cut. So this is your way of getting free leads. These leads will take care of all whatever costs you're doing with anything else. If you just make a list of all the limousine companies in the areas that you are, contact them and say, let me be your uh, your party bus dude and I'm going to pay you. Yes. Okay, yes. Well, what, what, what do I need to do? Oh, well, you just make a little button that says need a party bus. Go here on your homepage. I say, OK. All right. That's it. Yeah, that's it. And well, how do we track it? Well, they're going to have a form that says, how did you find me? And it's going to say through your company or we can, you know, put tracking pixels, all different solutions, blah, blah, blah. Boom. So that's very simple. That's something you can do in the next 30 minutes. Get one or two people. If they're ranking on the first page of Google, let's say you go through three cities and you get, um, um, you know, two or three people from each city that's ranking at the top of Google. If they're major cities is getting at least hundreds of searches per month, right? Yeah. So at least three to five extra leads per city per day that you don't have to pay for. Thumbtack is awesome, but these are leads that you won't even have to pay for. Yeah. You see what yeah, I'm I saying? I need that. Yeah, for sure. I, um, <laughs> so I haven't started getting integration partners, but I did hear you talk about that yesterday on the on the call. So that's that's one thing I'm definitely hopping on as soon as possible. Yes, please. Just, look, if you obsess over that, then you really won't need anything else. You'll be able to leave everything else. This is um, <laughs> what's the uh, <laughs> what's the smartest what's the smartest uh, 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 wealthiest animal? The smartest wealthiest animal. I don't know. That's a that's a good question. <laughs> The Bible, Us? the Bible says it's a spider, because if we wanted to get inside a mansion, we would have to work hard our entire lives, become rich and then purchase the mansion. But a spider can just go and like build, a, you know, a web in the corner of the mansion. Right. So, yeah. so yeah. It's, about, it's about leveraging. So these people have worked very hard to get to the first page of Google and then to the top of Google and get all the traffic that they're getting. You can simply make one phone call right now <laughs> yeah. and be at the top of Google. And the good thing about it is when those pages are already ranking, when their websites are ranking already at the top of Google, they become authority sites. So if they make an extra page for you, it's, that page is already attached to a domain that has authority. So that brand new page will start ranking faster than any other page. So if they make a party bus page on their limo site for you and they're ranking at the top of Google, then they'll start outranking those already existing party bus sites. So you got somebody else doing your SEO for you. Gotcha. gotcha. So, yeah. So it's, this is just something that I believe all y'all should implement. This is what I'm doing for, for the school. Uh, this is what I'm going to be doing for, uh, I might, I might bring the agency back. I don't know. But for the school, definitely this year. Just integration, integration. Instead of starting from scratch and all of that extra stuff, how do you leverage what others have built? Okay? Yep. Got all it. right. So think, do that, man. I know you are, though. I ain't yeah. Even really, like, I'm winning right now. Like, I'm... I'm taking notes. Uh, that's that's like the first thing I'm on to do list because it, it makes so much sense. We get to leverage, you know, their work and their ranking, and yeah. just like that spider analogy, like just for sure. You know and what it's I mean? a win-win though. It's a win-win because yeah. 
they got to turn people down. Like if they don't have a party bus, they like you said, they either got to outsource it and you can be their dedicated person now. OK, well, I might as well make a page for this. You mm-hmm. see what I'm saying? So, all right. Do you have any questions for me before we ride off into the sunset? Um, I think that's about it. I had a question about, you know, how you uh, organize all your leads and stuff. You you already gave me an answer to that. Um, yeah, I think I think I'm good to go. I think I'm good to go. I'm just gonna. So, uh, as far as asking them to put us on their website, we we want them to give us an actual page on their website, or just give or just have our link to our website mm-hmm. on their page. You know, is what they're comfortable with. Yeah. But I would suggest a full page, right? So you just ask them, hey, look, you don't have to do it. Put me in contact with your developer. Okay. You know, 10 minutes. Matter of fact, I could just paste all the content on there myself if you don't mind. Hold on. Yep. So you can <laughs> technically, you could just, you know, if you ever did anything with sites, you can just do it yourself. But if they're not comfortable with all of that, then just have them create a little button that says go here for party buses. Very okay. simple. They can do that in like five freaking minutes, and it's not going to imp- It's not going to mess up any conversions from people that want limos and all of that stuff. So, I mean, you do that with a couple people, then 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 you're pretty much <laughs> you're good, man. Like, like I said, if I knew this stuff back then, man, I, I would have been able to sell for more than what I sold for first of all. But I definitely, yeah. I probably wouldn't even sold it at least for now for another three years because yeah but <laughs> this stuff right here i've been doing is uh i first started doing this stuff with pay-per-call offers mm-hmm. uh, in affiliate marketing and i was doing it with uh i was doing it with uh what do you call it uh rehab those rehab phone calls are between eight hundred dollars to twenty six hundred dollars so I was finding little blogs and stuff that weren't that weren't monetized, but these blogs will be ranking for addiction terms and all of this stuff like that. And then we we'll just I just hit them up or email them like, "Yo, um, I see you're not monetizing this other than ads. I'm partnered with a treatment center. You know, can I put my number on here and I'll split what I get with you?" And they will let me do it. So we getting calls for eight hundred. Twenty six hundred dollars just phone calls. You know That's crazy. That's yeah. genius. That's genius. Yeah, man. yeah. So no sales involved. So th- that's the powerful part about integration marketing. If they're on there for transportation, you don't have to really like pitch to them or convince them. If if it's their birthday and they see a party bus, you don't have to convince them or pitch them. So you you being an option on there for whatever event, if it's a funeral, of course, they're not going to want a party bus. But if, you know, depending on the the event, they're going to just be going there like that every single damn day. And you don't even have to pay for those leads. man. So. Yes, sir. Got it. All right, man. So you enjoy the rest of your day. I appreciate you coming on here, man. Oh, before I go. Would you suggest that people take advantage of copy and paste rentals program? Yes, for sure. 100%. 100%. And then, and if you do invest, just make sure you take action because a lot of the people that aren't taking action is like mind blowing because, you know, it's it's simple. It, it's it's literally simple. $7 to get in the community. <laughs> this is why I just started the um, the 15, uh, 15 days to 15K challenge. Yeah. All right. The 15K, the 15, uh, the 15 days of 15K challenge is literally me just forcing you do everything I say, because if like some people are self-starters like you, but other people need somebody there like on the call with them. Like if I tell them to get partners, they're not going to do it on their own. Some people are like that. But if I'm on the like like how we are right now and I'm doing it with them and all of that stuff, then they don't have a choice but to get results. If I'm on there with them right now and we're uh, um, setting up the thumbtacks from their side and doing all that, they don't have a choice. And I, I hate having to do all of that like one on one manual stuff. But that's the only way I can get people to like like see how simple it is. It's very simple. Like, um, how much technical stuff do you know? Like, how much technical stuff do you know? 
I, honestly, I'm not too technical. Like, I'm not too technical at all. But um, I'm able to set up a account, like like a social media account. It's just like a Facebook. You just put your info in, write your description, and just wait for the lead to come in. Come on, man. Like, that's why I, I keep trying to say it's just like setting up your damn Instagram. Right? Literally. It, you get your irresistible offer. That's the that's the most technical. We didn't went so far. Have you started doing SEO yet? No, not at all. Not at all. <laughs> <laughs> it's frustrating because all my old courses were extremely technical. Like yeah. you weren't seeing no results without getting down in. In you, you see what I'm saying. So that's why I was so proud of bringing this this opportunity with this community right here. Because I'm like, okay, 97 bucks. I made it copy and pasteable. They're yeah. literally doing stuff that they do on a regular basis. You're on social media. You're on, you, you're making profiles, and then you're responding to people that that reach out to you. Like yeah. they reach out to you, man. It don't get no more. Like and and Shaquem, I'm not trying to talk bad, but it's just these are grown ups. So I'm like, yeah. I'm not going to baby no grown up. I feel like this is the level that any person without a mental disability should be able to, to create a, a profile of, you know, is thumbtack tutorials on YouTube is mm -hmm. I'm on, I'm doing, I'm doing live streams multiple times a week to answer questions. Many are called, but few are chosen. I just, I just say that. So, if <laughs> I gotta keep doing these reviews, you know, updates with you, and you keep making a lot of money, and nobody else do, then oh well, y'all just keep missing out. You're <laughs> yep, more for me, more for me. I'm gonna just expand that much, that much wider. <laughs> hey, he's gonna do these integration partnerships, so y'all oh, really yeah. gonna see some magnificence in your presence. All right, man, you have a good day. All right. All right, man. You too. Appreciate it. All right.